Welcome back to FYI Philly. It's been a long, hot summer, right? I don't right? think anyone is going to argue no. with you on that front, but we found two brand new ways to cool you down in two minutes flat. Okay, it's called cryotherapy, and it's literally putting your body on ice dry ice. Yeah, that would make me cry too. Uh, proponents claim it will not only cool you down, but help you lose weight, improve athletic performance, and cure whatever ails you. There you go. The cryosauna looks like a giant freezer, and essentially it is. During a two-minute treatment, the temperature inside will drop to minus 190 degrees Celsius. That's negative 310 Fahrenheit. Feeling good? Yeah. Constantine Jilkin and his sister Anna have brought cryotherapy to Philadelphia's 12th Street Gym, the first on the East Coast. So it's hot and it's new. Constantine says cryotherapy is great for those looking to get fit, claiming it reduces cellulite, speeds metabolism so you burn as much as 1,000 calories over six hours, and heals achy muscles post-workout. That works this way. Your brain starts to scan all your body to find where is the stress coming from because it's very it's a little bit shocking for the body and if it finds any disorders it starts to fix them immediately muscle healing was my number one thing Kristen Noblet is a trainer at 12th Street gym teaching three classes a day her body takes a beating so she checked out their cryo sauna for herself and for her clients you have people with pain issues you have people with weight loss issues their metabolism stuck and it's said to help all those things so I would love to see what it does and work with that. For the treatment, you don warm booties and oven mitts to protect the extremities. Ooh, starting to go numb. Ideally, you wear nothing else but underwear. So how does it feel to stand near naked in such cold? I was cold at first, and all of a sudden it started feeling, you know, kind of euphoric and feeling good about, you know, I guess what you do in life. It feels like I'm just melting, I'm floating. I've never taken drugs, but it almost feels like you're high when you come out, like it, it's wonderful. Cryotherapy was invented by a Japanese doctor in the late 1970s as a treatment for arthritis, but it was a Russian scientist who developed the cryosauna, as a therapy seemed to help some patients control allergies, diabetes, alcohol, and drug addiction and stress. It can actually help to prevent any diseases. It corrects any physiological processes in your body, so it's a very good health-improving treatment. Oriel Dennis uses the cryosauna to keep her chronic migraines at bay. I usually get them two to three times a week, and having the cryotherapy has taken it down to two to three times a month. Her migraine medication usually makes her nauseous. And with this, you know, my side effect is weight loss and reduced cellulite, so I can deal with these side effects. <laughs> While the evidence of its effectiveness is a little mixed, some professional athletes use cryotherapy to heal their muscles faster so they can train that much harder. In Europe, they actually have cryotherapy rooms where whole groups of people get together and do the treatments together. And they can complain at the same time of how uh -huh, cold yeah. they are. Yeah. <laughs> kind of like a reversal sauna. Something like that. 